Last time on Genlock. So, Cammy is made of flow? Chase has been seeing his nemesis version of himself? I I'm not sure what that thing is. Uh, they tried to blow up the Holons, but they were intercepted by Miranda, who had Chase's sister, and they were trying to talk him out of of doing it, because, I mean, he was going to blow himself up along with it. I guess his want to just destroy all copies was just, that was what was going on? Yeah, I, I'm not really sure how to feel about any of this. Any of what's been going on in this series, it's, it's really hard to tell how I should be feeling, but, I mean, what is there to do? Let's see what happens next. Okay, he's still working on Unlock. That's right, they captured Sinclair. Okay, what's gonna happen now? Oh, is that Cammy? <laughs> this guy is so casual, it's just like, Oh, we're being invaded? Oh, but I know those guys, it'll be fine. Yeah, Sinclair was put inside the uh, Odin unit that looks like a friggin' Eva. Oh, they've taken back so much territory. Oh, what's gonna happen next? Let's see. Twilight. Okay. That's a short title. Migas. Run! Run, motherfucker! Oh, oh my god! Whoa! Jesus! Yo! <laughs> okay. Poor bastard. Oh yeah, Cammy. Just back and just casual about it too. Send it into the flow and made of it now and uh, wait that's all you got to say you hear cammy's ascended into the flow and you're just like eh, i'm so glad you're okay we've barely really thought about you since you've been gone but it's cool that you're back and made of nano just now you got this evangelion looking motherfucker coming up ah oh, sinclair poor bastard he's literally their slave jeez big boy Gungnir. Ah, oh, the weapon is named after Odin's spear. Okay. Oof. That's a big old blast. So, uh... Is Marine just, like, will kill Miranda too if we have to? Is, is Miranda now part of the Genlock team? Is that what's happening? Wait, Burrow? Are they gonna pull a Bugs Bunny? Why can this thing burrow? Okay, she's gonna say, fuck it. How is your hand not bleeding? Yeah, she's just like, okay, destroy them all. I can't get in contact with Miranda, just kill them all. What a bitch. I oh, am. Yeah, Chase is still going through his thing. Come with me if you want your suffering to end. Okay, I guess Miranda's just in charge of things now. Jeez. They're freaking pulling a Bugs Bunny. That is so goofy looking. God, this thing running is goofy looking too! Yeah, Sinclair, uh, doesn't have much of a choice in terms of working with the polity. Uh, how are you guys gonna save Sinclair? Ah, uh, it's got wrist-mounted guns too. Okay. Oh jeez, hang on, Val. Oh Jesus, what the heck? That's freaky. Wants to go out and help everyone. Yeah. Questioning why he was basically on a suicide mission. It was because he was trying not to become like the nemesis. Can Cammy help him now? Because, you know, she's now, I guess, a virtual existence too. So, is he finally going to confront this thing? I guess he is. Wait, the what? Oh, the seawall. Oh, and, uh, yeah, people are drowning too. <laughs> Jesus. Everything really is just going to shit. Poor bastards. That's a terrifying way to go. He's just gonna do what he did again. Just send out the... Send out the... Whatchamacallit. And just have it take everyone. The flow. Just indiscriminate ascension. We made their choice for them. God. Ugh. Tried to help them out and they... You know, just took it all. Oh god. Oh, that looks so painful. Oh, God. Yeah, she is not having any of this. She keeps ending up bouncing from one extreme to the other, and they're all just wrong. God. This thing just burrowing underground! My God! That's so weird! And this thing. Jeez. Not as intimidating as I thought it would be. It's just bigger robot. Oh god, this thing is just hanging out with his friggin' mom. That's so weird. But then again, it's 
also chase, so I guess that makes sense. Eh, what a good boy, closing the door behind him. Now this thing's just moving across the land. So yeah, I guess we're just cool with Miranda now. God, things feel so weird. How am I supposed to be taking most of this stuff? And now she can just do whatever, I guess. It really is hard to, like, take Cammy in a comedic light anymore because of the way she went out. Like, that whole episode is seared into my brain. I feel like I was traumatized by it. Like, it's really hard to find any of this cool or whatever. Also, what was her plan there? Was she really just gonna punch it? Oh, God. Uh, you alright, Cammy? Access denied. Oh, yeah, this asshole. Okay. Locked her out. Got it. <laughs> Ooh, nice! Got a mean left hook. And she keeps getting wrapped up with jerks. Oh, is, is Chase just viewing everything that the Nemesis Chase went through? Like a video? Oh, yeah! I completely forgot about that. At the end of last season. Letting him know all the stuff that he wasn't there for. Finding out that his mom was polity and all that. I mean, Union. Is it? Is this just trying to get him to mourn? His losses? Yeah, just trying to get him to take some time and just feel. And yeah, I guess he has been so single-minded up until this point. I don't know. I mean, I get it, but I don't know how I feel feel about this. Like, I feel like I should sympathize with what he's going through, but I don't know, just not feeling it. And yeah, how does Cammy work now? Like, is she like a living being anymore? Like, how does she work? Okay. Oh, what the? What? Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit! Freaking took his arm! No, no, no! What, what the fuck? I, I guess it needed to, like, obtain more mass? Is, is that how that works? So, was it just reforming Cammy through the mask that she gave up to the flow before and then she lost that mask and she just took it from Mingus? That is freaking dark, dude! I really just cannot understand the vibe this series has been going for. That is messed up! Oh yeah, now she's finding out that they just unleashed the flow. What you gonna do now, Marine? Man, she's so quick to call them fanatics. What are you, General? Aside from a bitch. Oh god. Poor Ming is... God, she looks wet. I don't know how I feel about overly shiny Cammy. Just reached out and just consumed him. God, isn't that this show in a nutshell? He's gonna get... Yeah, don't worry, he's just gonna get a new arm. It's all good. Yeah, I'm really not sure how I'm supposed to feel about Cammy and her new existence. Should I be happy that she's back? And that really doesn't take away from the fact that she technically still offed herself in the way she did it. Ugh. Oh no. Okay, are we gonna understand how she managed to came back? So she ascended and then came right back? Wait, it was Genlock? Wait, final directive? Wait, is he suggesting that maybe they might make it so that everyone becomes part of the flow in order for humanity to survive the end of days on Earth? I don't know how I feel about that, dude. And they only survive- Cammy only survived because of Genlock. Wait, it, it, he's terminating! What? What? Is, is that all we're getting from AI Weller? I feel like we barely even even got to have this thing around. Then again, Weller did die last season, but I mean, am I supposed to be sad that he's gone? I mean, okay, Cammy is a fusion between Union and Polity, but again, the way it came about was just really depressing. I, I, I feel like I'd feel very differently about this if it was in, like an accident. Or she had sacrificed herself or something else, but I mean, she was just accepting a nihilistic view and just going into the ether. Man, this thing cannot aim for shit. Oh, never mind, spoke too soon. Uh, is Val gonna be okay? Oh my god! That was a heavy hit, the moment when his mom ascended. This is the weirdest healing process. Okay, what's the way forward for Chase then? Okay, what's the plan here? So, she was able to come back from Genlock. I don't feel like I understand. Is he gonna use Cammy's brain pattern in order to make it so that people can continue existing even if they end up in the flow? I mean, it does make sense. I mean, they digitized their brain 
anyway, so of course they'd be able to maintain a physical form. Also, Kazu! Kazu, what the fuck? Your sense of humor is still terrifying. Yeah, Val was just kind of looking to just be done. You helped me do many things I didn't think I could do. So let me help you now, from here. Is Kazu still alive? Somehow? I'm very confused. So, this chase and the Nemesis chase are gonna merge? Two halves of one whole? Huh, he has a scar now. And, okay, Mingus is just okay now. Got a robot arm, we're all good. I, I feel like we should be addressing what happened to Mingus. Like, dude! <sighs> I feel like this show is just yada yadaing over a lot of really important stuff. Like, we're just cool with Miranda, not really addressing what happened with Cammy. Just, just, we're just gonna keep rolling. Okay, whatever. Like, how have you recovered so fast? You just lost your damn arm, dude. I mean, I would have expected him to at least be side-eyeing Cammy a little bit. Oh, jeez. Okay, what is she doing? Getting to Sinclair? Oh, he's free! Nice! Wait, was nobody guarding him? Also, were the rest of the Hollands, the Genlock Hollands destroyed? God, I feel like that thing just disappearing underground like that should not work the way it does. Okay, he's done it. What does that mean, though? And he's contacting Hallcraft? Uh, should they be that close to all of this? Oh my- oh, oh my god! Were they just absorbed into the friggin' flow? What the f- You know what? You know what? No, 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 no. Oh, it's called the Demon King. King Demon? Whatever. I I don't know how to feel about any of this. Honestly. Things just keep happening. They just keep happening, and they, I'm not given enough time to, like, process things. And now, like, did they just all get absorbed into the flow? I mean, I guess they'll be fine since they're Genlock compatible, but... What now? I really have no idea where any of this is going anymore. <sighs> okay, so Chase has gotten over his personal issues. Val has done something with Kazu's consciousness? Sinclair has been freed and unleashed within the polity base within the anvil. Uh, Cammy was the key to people surviving within the flow, I guess? Henry contacted Holcraft, which, I don't know if I should be trusting Henry at all. Weller's AI is gone, and I don't know if I should have cared about that moment? Cammy is composed of flow. Miranda is with the Genlock team now. <sighs> Things just keep happening. And there's no time to really dwell on it. Not enough of an explanation on how things happened. And people just don't react to things the way I feel like people should be reacting to things. Mingus lost a friggin' arm! Ugh. Nobody had any real reaction to Cammy saying, I ascended into the flow. Like, I, you know, I would think you'd be freaking out like you did what? Some kind of reaction to Miranda. I have no idea where this series is going. And it's just like, the dark, darker tones are fine. Whatever. You can have a darker tone. You can go from a lighter tone to a darker tone. Blood guts everywhere. I mean, literally, if you're watching Young Justice, you've seen it happen. But with that, there was a progression of events. You can follow certain things. Certain things that are easy to have inferred. They don't always spell things out for you. But you can use context clues to kind of get to where you need to be. Is that the best way of doing things? No. But it works. With this, I feel like you need more and they're not giving this series enough time to breathe. And I don't understand why. Like, they're just trying to rush through all of this. Like, the destination isn't worth it if you just skip over all the details on how you got to the end. <sighs> This is so frustrating, because I'm still curious as to where all of this is going, but I, I really wouldn't be surprised if this was the final season, because that's what it feels like, like you're trying to cram in two seasons worth of content into one. Like, Kazu's death still has barely registered for me, Cammy's whole ascension still feels weird, and I don't feel like I can joke about it in any capacity because of the way that episode ended. Like, dude, putting a suicide 
hotline at the end of that makes me feel some kind of way. You really went out of your way to tell me Cammy committed suicide. And now she's back, and nobody is commenting on it. Like, dude, that feels really important, and it feels like you really aren't taking that seriously. So I don't know how to feel. I don't, I don't know how to feel about any of this. And, and what's the solution here? Everyone just gets absorbed into the flow, but they just become beings within the cloud. I mean, I, that was ultimately what they were becoming. You know, Earth is fucked, so... <sighs> Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I'm not angry, I'm just confused. I am so confused. I don't know what I'm supposed to think. I don't know what I'm supposed to take away from anything that I saw in this episode. Anything that I've seen in the past season. Where is this leading? Oh, you know, it, it feels like the writers just... There are episodes missing. It, it just constantly feels like there are episodes that are supposed to happen in the middle of some of these episodes or before and after some of these episodes. I don't know. But I leave it to you. What do you think all of this is leading to? Why are things the way they are here? Because this feels sloppy. Like, they didn't go in with a plan on where this season was supposed to go. And considering the amount of time between season 1 and season 2, like, dang, guys. I don't know what to think. Maybe there's something deeper behind the scenes that I'm missing. So again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I'd love to hear comments from you. Lay it on me. Help me understand, because I, I guess I'm an idiot. And do all the YouTube stuff if you like this video or don't. I ain't your daddy, but I love you like one. And until next time, I've been Dudes This Zen, and I hope I see you before the sun sets on Twilight. Whatever that means.